Hello and good day. This is our third travel vlog. Um, in this part now, it's late e at the evening, uh, maybe 10 p.m. or something. Um, usually at this time I should be already camp, ha have a camp somewhere. But now I'm looking so something good spot where I can be at peace. Uh, but I noticed this windmill and I like them. When you get near near them, they are so big. I have a had a plan that I camp over the side of the forest, but I don't know why I did it. Maybe it was too exposed. Now we're going to swimming because we don't have a shower, but let's hope we can camp somewhere. If nothing else, there after swimming. Okay, now I just admiring the windmill, but now I take a round of this place, see if there's camera, camera security or something that I couldn't why I couldn't be there so this is my spare option to go if I don't find anything else so uh, I actually found out that there's a, a beach here that's that's the thing that I always seek at the evening of the evening going to the beach where nobody swim at the evening and late at the summer when it's cold so I could wash myself there nicely, privately. But when I got here, uh, my footage of this film got destroyed, corrupted or something. But I went to, through this place and there were camp, some camp going on there, so, like a ten tents there. So, and a small beach area on the left side of there. So. Everyone was sleeping. Let's see his corrupt file. Darn! Now I try to <laughs> go to swim and wash myself. Guess I could wash myself here, even though it's a swimming beach. Seeking the place is getting more and more nerve-wracking and intense. And oh, wind! Oh, what glitches? Glitches are taking over. What? What's the, what? Everything's freezing. What's going on? It's like 12 p.m. right here in Finland. It's probably more light in Lapland, more northern Lapland. But now I'm pretty south Lapland. Here's another structure there. This collapsed barn or something. And I picked up a spot where I checked out that there's a lot of grass that not recently there haven't here and, and that the field are uncut and kind of uh, marks that they're, they're not going to come here very soon so but still I want caution and hide there my let's go from the other side see if you can see
there's my bike and tent. Pretty good. Probably ain't gonna sp spot it on the road if you aren't specifically st watching straight to it. So, by the way, I found a history house for the how many years I have been tracked it, like three years since then I first found it. I have tried to find it again, but now I found it. Uh, I couldn't go there because some, some farm guys was doing some tractor work at the rig in almost middle of the night. Uh, but, but maybe tomorrow I could make a revisit, which is can be a little bit hard, but had to be real, real pretty fast because they have taken down some trees and that kind of camouflage stuff and I can't really hide Louise anywhere so it's going to be have to be a quick revisit revis revis so yeah sometimes <coughs> it's uh, 4 a.m. I think I'm going to get asleep soon. It's cold in here actually. Uh, what a new gas. Well, you are. Yeah. What a new gas tank. That kind of thing. I am <laughs> heating myself some water already. It's so swallowing up my next meal before I go to sleep so I heating up the rest of the water in this tent so it's like a mini sauna uh, and I get a little bit warmer oh it's on YouTube oh it's Penny logo in there um, hmm nice tent good hideout Hope we don't get caught. Oh, he'll get steamed again. So I'm a little bit tired. I'm constantly pondering I wanna go home, but I wanna go to to another town which has a lot of places. It's more near to my home. But I'm so trained out of the energy for some reason. Maybe more water, more, more good food and uh, gin, 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 gin. I actually haven't drink, drank any energy drinks. Maybe, maybe it should. Maybe it's because of that. Maybe I should drink those. And eat uh, some lousy burger that has way too much mayonnaise. <laughs> uh, this is a fourth day in this trip. And we have still like uh, Friday, well, Saturday, four days we can be here if we want more after this fifth day. Well, I start eating soon. 4 a.m. It's getting the light. Now I'm babbling. <laughs> Let's stop before it went too overboard. When you move every day into every different place and have to pack, have to unpack, uh, sometimes it's, it's a little tiresome to make it all really tight in the, your mo motorcycle that everything is fine and you know that backpack <laughs> weights 40 kilos it's very heavy and like I said on that, on that text that at the, that moment Lakeshore Drive motivated me <laughs> 
to do this packing. Yeah, all, all, yeah, look at these motorcycle shoes. They are running out of their life's time. It's, you actually can put a finger on that hole. It doesn't hold water anymore. Oh. I put that leg on the ground always when I turn, so that's why it's worn out. Oh, by the way, this camouflage is amazing. It's, it's blending so well to the... Oops. Oh. To the terrain, is that word? Yeah, it was... But, but uh, one flaw was when I used light, when it gets really dark, it shines through that tent. I shouldn't use too much light. If I want to stay in hidden, of course. And here's some speed up. How? Seven minutes. Actually, that is that is okay time. Um, actually, pretty neatly packed. Like, oh, like I, even uh, that I say, I say it myself. Uh, here's going to. Uh, I'm packing the camouflage of the bike, which is also amazing. Oh, yeah. Camouflage. Thank you, Dad, for that gift. Freaking hello. I don't know what that uh, freak out, little freak out was about, but I think losing your mind a little bit when you do this kind of stuff, and especially when you put together some IKEA stuff, the losing your mind is part of the process. Only five kilometers to history house. Bye. It was nice, nice place to sleep. And actually, randomly, I didn't know it was this way. There's, there's the history house. They have been cutting some trees on the sides, so it's more visible now. Hmm. I have to investigate. Always. Hello and good day. Overall, I think you this left to bother you. So quickly, uh, in light, Larry, join our forces. Mm -hmm. Little spider and not much else. But you could hide there if you want to.
Oh, let's go just talk to him. We have our mouth guard with us if we want to fight. Really, really weird that I come to talk to him through window. <laughs> but this is my life. Ouch. Ahí ve. ¿Qué pasa, Luis? ¿Qué pasa? 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 ¿Qué Ei muuta kuin näkemi. Hyvä, jatka. Okei. Tuossa on vittu always. I have so much good luck that I run into people who are understanding. Mm -hmm. uh, what this place used to be, and what this used to be. There has been many thieves. Someone they got caught. He tried to steal something. Uh, what is this? Someone tried to steal something from there. So. They catch the him, or they, they they catch the freaking thing that he tried to steal, but he failed. So a few people have been inside there. Is there anyone urban explorer who admits you been here in this house? Anyway, I have to have to. I take a few couple of photos from outside if there's a thumbnail possibility. Ah, oh, my bicep, bicep, a little stretched. So, episode is ending. Uh, I mean, ended. And now we are going to start drive home. It's going to probably, probably will be hard drive. Glad, glad that I always have a nice people comforting me, courting me. It's all. I don't know if it's a trick or any that I just have a camera and, and smile and greet politely. Politeness is always a good thing in everything. That's what I learned from like very young. How much time is it? Almost seven. I don't have many hours light anymore. I mean it's warm. Yes, I should put another shirt. Just in case. Let's put it when we get cold. No, let's put it now. I see a lot of those side side buildings of those houses. It's like I said before. It's really frustrating because neighbors are so near. I would love to explore them, and and I don't want to go and ask <laughs> permission. Oh, here's cows and ponies and... Uh, are those goats? I don't know. I like to yell at them. Once I played music at them. Oh, blue tractor X. So the cows got confused. I've even filmed it. I have it somewhere in my phone. I show it sometimes. Yeah. Oh, this this drive, what is that hole? Maybe fake lake? Is it fake lake? I don't know. Mining thingy? 
Ooh, white bloat is coming. What, what was that? I don't know. Only 500 kilometers to go. That's three, uh, 310 miles. Oh, this is going to be heavy. <laughs> Especially the end part when it's sound, sound it doesn't really show. show. Not that also shine and it's really cold and it's usually windy and, and end part of end part of my home for some reason. Yeah, it just struggled at the end. <laughs> it's always something, always something mesmerizing driving through through these silky roads in a heavily wooded area with some nice random houses. Must be peaceful to live there. Yeah. This is great. This is amazing. You should definitely try this to let your brains breathe. Next thing to a uh, flying. I just should leave these driving bits here. You wouldn't need anything else. There's nothing really to comment about. But these Finnish roads are really nice. And now there's no reindeers even at all when it's not it's a little bit cold now, so there's not so much bugs, so no reindeers on the road escaping bugs. The sun is getting a little bit lower. You can see the um, shadows stretching. And I say it's getting much, much more beautiful after to, with that sun when it's getting lower and lower. And I don't feel alone in these roads, even though it's get dark and gloomy uh, half a tank almost 90 Euro, euros usually this tank is 20 euro, 20 euros and it's not very cheap i counted that this trip cost me like two and a half two and a half 250 euros to gases <laughs> That's where you guys help me in the Patreon. I appreciate that <laughs> really much. Yeah, let's keep on going. We have like a three and a half, 350 kilometers left. <laughs> it's cold and dark soon. Is that water tower? Are there anyone in here that recognizes that? Hmm. Tractor X? Driving around? There have been a lot of road works to this year in Finland. Really much. Plus side that we get a very good roads, but we have to wait a lot. Yay, freedom! <laughs> yeah, where is next? To the dark woods. I thought that big building was abandoned, but it wasn't. Uh, there was a light in the window. But at least we got to see the car. Let's go. Three, three and three hundred fifty kilometers left, I think. All right, car lovers. What kind of car is that? What mark? 
tell me about it. You know, I don't know much about cars, but you, there are many of you that know. Okay, let's take this tiny, tiny. Mm, there's a light on the window. I thought that was abandoned. <laughs> Creepy. Okay, let's get to the main road back. Back to the home. Back to the light. Towards the light. Ah. The clouds are playing with me. Painting the nice picture to the sky. And I'm glad that I start driving at the evening time. It gives me some kind of show. It feels like it. You just get a glimpse of it when you see it on the screen. But when you are actually there, just look at it. It's all around. It's massive. It's pretty looking. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Pink. Like a pink explosion. Pink explosion. <laughs> what was I thinking? I don't know. When you get tired and when you get driving, glad I'm actually this time pretty sharp. I don't feel sleepy at all. Just, just admiring the views that clouds are giving me. Such a show. And rarely cars. How much time is that about now? I think it's like a 10 p.m. or 9, 11 p.m. or something. I think so. This is at the end of the... Wait, January, February, March, April, May. End of the June, I think. Or middle of it. Very nice. Maybe I should sometime put just long versions of these on the channel without comments. Just try it. Yeah, imagine I just put like a 5% of my videos in these travel logs and urban exploration. <laughs> There's so much stupid stuff that I film. But this isn't it. It is like going towards the light. Mesmerizing. Ooh, field. Where's the pink scar? Pink vanished. Pink scar. Stupid commencement for me. How long? Let's check. 231 kilometers left. Give me money. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me money. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Money, money. Give me money. Now our trip is starting to end. We are starting to getting near the light. What happens there when we get there? Oh, nobody knows. It's getting dark. But then that's all actually looks like a atom bomb is frozen. It's like it's middle of the explosion <laughs> just stopped in the middle of it uh, pretty nice <laughs> pretty nice oh what a mesmerizing view even thumbnail worthy maybe maybe golden sun one of my favorite colors you 
against that warm yellow. On the road again. Cannot wait till I get on the road again. Making music with my friends. Da 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 da. And this is that. Oh, I start. I'm trying to do what that delving thing with my hand and with under the wind. But, oh, but, but okay. If you actually watched this far, I raised my Indiana Jones hat to you. Put in the comments if you actually watched the whole video. You must be true fans. Or my friends. Are you more my friends than fans? So please do thumb up. Maybe me, we get more views and I can raise a little bit of my budget in these videos. But anyway, but thumb up, subscribe and uh, push the other subscribe button which is called bell. Uh, and if you know someone who likes this kind of videos, relaxing, little kind of a funny videos, do share them, like in the Facebook or somewhere, I don't know. But we will see you in next episode. Bye-bye.